It's Wednesday the 2nd of April, we're looking at a weekly chart of nat gas. As you can see, the last three weeks have been held by this 200 week moving average quite nicely in fact, um, and we've really plunged this week. Uh, we looked at the daily chart, you can see this, uh, this, this trend lower really started at the end of February uh, for nat gas and we're just heading lower this week. Uh, we've broken this uh, trend line, which goes back to the beginning of November. So it's about a five month trend line that's been broken yesterday. We've just closed below it and of course we're heading lower again today. So next support we're looking for is the 100 day moving average at 42.20. We've um, also got a FIB support here at, um, at 41.95. So this is the area we look like we're going to head for. And uh, it, but it is quite a good support. There's there's plenty of room stochastics wise. They're still pointing lower. So there is room to head lower on the downside. Um, However, short term, just on the four hour chart, we are getting quite oversold. That doesn't mean that I think we should be buying into any longs at the moment. I don't think it's wise to fight this daily downtrend, especially now that we've broken this trend line yesterday, um, this five month trend line. But just be aware that the target today is probably around the 42.20, 41.95 area. And there is a chance that we can bottom out here for the week because uh, this is quite good support. Uh, resistance wise, obviously we've got the trend line here at 42 sort of 90 area. And if we get through there, which I think would be a struggle, I think it's unlikely that we will. But if we could, we could be looking at 43, 40, 43, 60 uh, as resistance, and that should hold any move higher at this stage.